Okay, so here we have triangle A, B, C, and we are going to translate it for our first transformation. We are going to go up 5 and left 2. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2. There's C prime. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1. There's A prime. One, two, three, four, five, one, two. And there's B prime. Alright, so we're going to connect these points. And we will have A prime, B prime, and C prime. So for A prime, our new coordinates are 8, 15. For B prime, our new coordinates are 8, 10. And for C prime, our new coordinates are 3, 10. Alright, so there we have our first translation. And so, time for the algebraic rule. We have A, B, and C. A was originally 10, 10. B was originally 10, 5. C was originally 5, 5. Alright, so A transformed into A prime, B transformed into B prime, and C transformed into C prime. A prime is 8, 15. B prime is 8, 10. And C prime is 3, 10. Alright, so, so our algebraic rule is... So for the x, we subtracted 2, and for our y, we added 5. Alright, so our first algebraic rule is x minus 2, y plus 5. Alright, so for our second transformation, we are going to do a, a reflection over the y axis. So a will become or a prime will become a double prime at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So there will be a prime prime or a double prime. B prime will transform into B double prime. And since it is only five coordinates or five down from a prime, I know to just go down five from a prime double prime here. So one, two, three, four, five. And we have B double prime. And for C prime, it will also transform into C double prime, which is one, two, three, one, two, three. And there's C double prime. Right, so connect these up. Alright, and for our coordinates, we have A prime has transformed into A double prime, which is at negative 8. 15. C double prime has transferred negative 3, 10. B double prime is at negative 8, 10. Right, and so there is triangle A double prime, B double prime, C double prime. And our algebraic rule for this one is 
Okay, so we had A prime, B prime, C prime. A prime was 8, 15. B prime was 8, 10. C prime was 3, 10. Alright, and so after our reflection, they turned into A double prime, B double prime, and C double prime. A double prime is at negative 8, 15. B double prime is at negative 8, 10. And C double prime is at negative 3, 10. Alright, and so Our algebraic expression would be since 8 turned into negative 8, 8 turned into negative 8, and 3 turned into negative 3, it's negative x, and y stays the same, so it'd be negative x, y. That's our algebraic rule for the second transformation. Anyhow.